What's up guys, Sam back again in Dawn of Destiny, taking on the Q team of Rare Hunter, Arcana, and Strings. Literally the scraping the bottom of the barrel of characters to duel. Anyway, uh, back onto the webcam stuff, I listened to your feedbacks that some of you guys commented on the last video. Thanks again for letting me know how you guys feel about it. And a lot of the consensus was they liked it, the videos are improved with webcam. And uh, one of the comments was, find a place to place your webcam up higher so it doesn't look like we're looking up your nose. And uh, I did that. So hopefully it's improved now. And if you want to leave me more feedback about how things are going, let me know. I also took some feedback on cutting out the duel where I lost. I had only, I've only lost like once in the past few towers. And five and six, I only have one loss. So, I cut out the last the loss on the last two parts. And if I lose here, I won't do it. As you can see, there are no attempts. So, look at this. This is one ugly motherfucker. Oh shit! I wasn't paying. It. I was just kind of like staring off into the distance. The duel had started without me. All right. Uh, this adds a hundred fiend spellcaster. I always. It's always a while before I last play. And so I always forget shit like that. It's one of my few spell cards you think I would know by now what it does. Let's see, we'll summon Sorcerer of the Damned. I can't attack this turn anyway, so I don't know why I'm making a big fuss about it. Boom, he's not going to do anything. Unless, something tells me he does actually have a bunch of good cards. Because he's the rare hunter. What is that, Graceful Charity? Cool. He was like, his face was like ultimate creeper. Like, when he activated it, like, chill the fuck out, dude. Alright, so I guess he's just... Are you drawing yourself out? What are you doing? Can you play two Pot of Greeds in a single turn? What's happening? He's just going at it. I don't remember, because Pot of Greeds been banned for so long. Watch this. One of these cards is Torrential Tribute. There's no way... One of these is not Torrential Tribute. Life Absorbing Machine. What does this do? As long as this card remains face up in the field, half the life points you pay in each turn are restored during... Okay. Good for you, man. Magic Cylinder? Just desserts. Okay. Controller, no. Apparently I was really upset about the Just Desserts that I had received. Not as upset as he's gonna be for the life point... Why wouldn't you just use negate attack on the first attack I did? That was stupid. Maybe you should fucking puff your cheeks out, man. And play your trap cards appropriately. I got nothing. I, I'm scraping the bottom of the barrel of jokes for this guy because who is he? And who cares? Okay, we'll attack. We'll just assume this guy's got low defense. Yup. What's his effect? I get... Okay, nothing. I probably should have played another monster and won the duel this turn. But something in me just thinks that he's got Torrential Tribute. And it's one of those things that he just forgot to activate it or like Trap Hole. So I'm just going to keep Vorse Raider in my hand. It's not a big deal. It's not like I'm almost losing this duel. I lost a thousand life points, but whatever. My cards are all monsters. So remember, like, I don't remember where I put the webcam in my last video. And, uh, that's fine. I'll figure it out. I'll look at, I'll go watch the last video and decide where to put this webcam. Because I have a lot of space to work with. I think I put it slightly above my hand on my side of the field. Look at how panicky he looks. What if the thumbnail this week is just them, their faces when they lose. Because normally I do their default faces where they're like, oh, and they're making, st hang on, I'm adjusting the camera, don't mind me. Please don't fall. It's bugging me, and I don't know, the position of it is bugging me, and I don't know why. Anyway, that's impossible. It's totally possible. Why does he have an Exodia background? He doesn't have Exodia, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that's not a thing. No, I don't need to edit my deck. Ooh, that's, oh, that's the ugly... Dark Magician guy. He also has the thing. I don't think... Dark Magician doesn't look like that in this game, though, so why is that his background? 
I remember this dude though. He's got like the magical hats and stuff too. And he's annoying. I think I remember this guy. I'm pretty sure. Comment if I'm thinking of the right episode. He like duels Yugi and also uses Dark Magician and has magical hats and stuff. Right? It's been a while since I've seen the show, so I could be totally wrong on that. Maybe not though. Oh, excuse that neck crack. That probably looked disgusting. Alright, that only has 12,000 attack. But I need to get rid of it before it goes in defense mode. Because I don't have anything with 2,000 attack. Damn it! This is the trap hole I was worried about last turn. God. There goes fucking Great White. I have another one, thankfully, but that's my turn. Dope. Oh, I'm gonna suffer two direct attacks this turn. I'm gonna lose to this guy, aren't I? Fuck me. I'm totally gonna lose to this guy. What is with this guy and the last guy? Both have, like, creeper faces when they attack you, and they're like, ah, I did damage. Shut up! Yeah, sure, stop making weird faces. I'm gonna lose this. There's no way I win this duel. Uh, okay. Maybe, if I place Penguin Soldier. Penguin Soldier will die, but I'll be able to put two of his monsters back in his hand. Hopefully he sacrifices these two for just one powerful monster. He gets greedy, and then... Only then, who did you just summon? Who is that? Okay, I'm glad you sacrificed it immediately. How bad, that was a good turn. Something tells me, you go back to your hand. And you go back to your hand. That wasn't really that effective. I mean, it got rid of them, but they're still totally in his hand and he can still definitely summon them this turn. Although, having a monster in attack mode... How much is this? 300? Having a monster in attack will probably shy him away from summoning that again. From summoning those monsters again. But we'll see if this isn't another trap. Are you kidding me? Alright, so I just won't play monsters. That's it. Fuck it, I can't summon a monster. I'll have to set my monsters for the rest of this fucking duel. Oh, it's fine. I'm still in this. That's definitely gonna hurt that I have so few life points and one guy left. I still have to get rid of the 4,000 of this dude's life points. That just vibrated weird on my leg. Uh, but why not? We'll just set Giant Soldier of Stone for now, because I'm very... not. I'm not confident in my ability to summon a monster, because something tells me he's got another Torrential Tribute, or he has a third Trap Hole, because you can have three of the same card in your deck, so why wouldn't he have a third trap hole? Black Pendant. Okay, so now that has 2,000 attack. Okay, cool. Now it has enough to get rid of my Giant Soldier of Stone, too. So fuck it. I'm dead. It didn't attack, though. The AI is uncharacteristically afraid to attack face-down monsters. I have no real reason to summon anything. Just keep summoning stuff till I can either draw a Millennium Shield... Or, I can draw, uh, Cosmo Queen. That sucks. It sacrificed itself again. I think it could have won if he just kept that out there. There goes Giant Soldier of Stone, of course. You stupid fuck. That, I guess, is a magician-looking card, but it really doesn't look like he has a lot of magicians. Crack the neck again, and we're gonna set this dude, because why not? End my turn. Okay. Oh, why? Why do you have three black pendants? Who puts the three of those in their deck? Besides you, of course. And you, I mean, you got to use them all in the same monster. I have like only one thing that can stop that in my deck right now. Will I draw it? Heart of the cards. I'll draw it this turn. Totally didn't. Never mind. It's destined for me to lose this duel. Set. Maybe not. I mean, I could totally draw him out. <laughs> and then have 1,800 life points left to duel the next guy. Probably not how it's going to go down, though. <sighs> if he, I mean, if he just keeps attacking with this monster, I can indefinitely summon 
keep him alive. Or keep my wall of defense alive. Alligator sword. Not also not appropriate for this situation. None of this is like what I want. <sighs> Normally I cut that out. I don't. I'll leave that one in. Don't know why. I guess because you can see me drink the water now. It's better than when I just drink the water before. Okay, just kill me already. I'm like just hanging in this duel by a thread. There's, I don't think there's any way I win other than by drawing him out. How many cards do you have left? 26. To my... Didn't he use a bunch of pot of greeds? Am I crazy? Oh, that was the other guy. Okay, so I guess I could draw him out, but... This... My duels are meshing together. I've played too much Yu-Gi-Oh. That's something I thought I would never say. I've played too much Yu-Gi-Oh. I don't remember which duel is which. I'm losing my mind. I just got... Fucking... I'm gonna lose this. Just kill me already! Attack! Flip those face-down monsters! Quit being a pussy! Because I, I'm apparently not gonna draw a Cosmo Queen, and I just... Part of the cards has abandoned me this duel. I'm not gonna get to win. It's decided. I can't get two monsters out to be sac- I'm gonna guess that's Millennium Shield. That's Millennium Shield. Congratulations. I can't imagine what other monster he would need to sacrifice to set other than Millennium Shield. Let's summon you. Special summon. I'm just gonna switch it to defense mode, but I wanna have three monsters out now. Hey. Okay. Here's the plan. We're gonna change you to defense mode. Which will allow me to set another monster. Ooh, now I have three cards. I might actually be able to summon Cosmo Queen now. If he only attacks one per turn. But he might flip one of those to summon another Millennium Shield. That's the only monster in this game I've seen sacrifice to set for. So... Maybe. Why the fuck not? If I could draw somebody who could kill him, that'd be awesome. Maybe Gemini Elf. No, Gemini Elf, even with all my stuff, wouldn't be enough. Because I'm trying to think. I have one card in this... Yeah, one card in this deck that can kill it now. 3,000 life points. Because I already have the equipped spell card I would need. But I need to draw it. Let's go! Not what I needed. Why is my controller not respond? Okay. It was like freaking out for a second. Alright. End my turn. Yes. Alright. Okay, kill that thing. Of course. He's like walled himself in. He can't place any more magic and trap. He can only summon one more monster. Come on, Cosmo Queen! Damn it! Who gives a fuck about Armored Lizard? Now, I don't even think Joey does, and I'm pretty sure Joey's the only one who uses it in the show. Mate, probably, probably, right? Who else would use it? It's a, co it's a fucking common card that has only 1,500 attacks. Sucks. Bye. This is the most damage that that monster has ever done, by the way. Still not Cosmo Queen. Okay. Bet you it's at the bottom of my deck. What is this? The Illusionary Gentleman. It's the most damage an Illusionary Gentleman has ever done in a duel. Up until now, it has never killed this many monsters in a single duel. But here it is, destroying my field. I don't even know why I'm still playing this. Just surrender. I can't win. Because then I have to beat the next guy with only 1,800 life points, and that's not going to happen. Although, people wanted a longer video, so here you go. Cosmo Queen! God. Damn, of course not. Of course not. Why would it have been Cosmo Queen? Because I need Cosmo Queen? Would that have been why I would have drawn Cosmo Queen? No, because I needed Cosmo Queen, so it wouldn't happen. I'm going to just keep saying Cosmo Queen until the universe cosmically... I 
had to give up. Mentally, I just died in that statement. Force Raider. Cool, I can't wait to use Force Raider to attack. Oh, wait. I can't. End of my turn. I have, like, all my most powerful monsters in my hand right now. And I can't do anything. Because he has three black pennants attached to that thing. You know what also would be good here, actually? No, it wouldn't. I was going to say Harpy's Feather Duster. Would I lose even if I kill those things? I think I totally would. Well, this card is sent from the field of the graveyard and inflict 500. So I'd have... Best case scenario, I win this duel with 300 life points left. This might be the first time I just have to straight up surrender in this series. I think it might be. Because unless I draw him out, I'm only going to have 300 life points left. Who's that? What'd you just summon? Dark Magician. Okay, but Yugi used Dark Magician. Definitely didn't look like that. Aha! Fuck you. Millennium Shield in the clutch. I'd have lost both my monsters that turn if I didn't get it. Is that another illusionary, illusionary gentleman? Oh, damn it. Yep, okay. There's no way... I can win this other than a draw out. In fact, now I should win by draw out because I would lose 1500 life points if I killed that illusionary gentleman. Right? Why would you attack with Dark Magician instead of your illusionary gentleman with 3000 attack? What did you just summon? What was that? What was the point of what you just summoned? Still don't have Cosmo Queen, by the way. Now it doesn't ma matter, but I still don't have Cosmo Queen, so that's cool. God damn. All right. Leo Wizard. Okay. Defense. Boom. Shocking. He killed it with Dark Magician. Ugh. This is painful to watch. But the comments wanted to show me losing. And this is normally what happens when I lose, is that a duel just doesn't end. That's the only real way I've lost in the past few. Okay, Dark Magician. Kill that thing. It's a slow... Slow burn for this duel, but I might win still. I don't know how many he might not be able to kill on your shield because he can't set any more of his trap cards. Slate Warrior. How many cards do you have left? 13. Okay. Slate Warrior's effect might be helpful here, but I think it's just going to be Dark Magician attacking for whatever reason instead of his Gentlemanly Warrior. Or Illusion of Deathful. Fuck! What's it called? Illusionary Gentleman. There we go. Okay, but see, I can actually kill Dark Magician. Why does that... I thought Dark Magician had 2400 attack. Maybe not. Maybe I'm wrong. Does it lose 500 or 900? Oh, there goes the third trap hole. And wow. Set. Maybe I should just stop sending setting monsters. It'll end this duel faster. Because Millennium Shield isn't going anywhere. I Just in case... Ooh. Boom. Are you having fun, Arcana? Are you having fun? Because I'm not. I stopped having fun a long time ago. Ooh, Royal Decree, which doesn't matter because those are all spell cards. End my turn. I'm not even so many monsters anymore. I just don't want him to attack. Because he's going to draw, end this turn, keep going. Okay, yeah, that's gonna speed up the duel if I just don't summon anything. I'll activate Royal Decree. And then. No way! What? Shut up! We've been dueling for like 20 minutes! I don't need to play Yami. This is it. This is how we beat Arcana Millennium Shield. 
face up defense mode. Because Cosmo Queen was actually the last monster in my deck. Has to be. Still haven't drawn it. Thanks for abandoning me, heart of the cards. I thought this duel was going to be quick. End your turn. Yep. This card. Oh, right. I see what it's saying. Fuck it. You go. Why not? Why not? In fact, next turn I'm going to set both two cards just because I don't want it to ask me to discard. No, I can't play Maneater Bug because I don't want to... Uh, at this point, I've committed to the uh, discard thing. I've committed to just drawing them out. I don't want to destroy Illusionary Gentleman because I'll lose 1,500 life points. And I've made him draw so much already. Fuck it. Let's just commit to it now. Because that's the best case scenario for me to have more than 300 life points while dueling the next person. Oh, another Dark Magician, I'm assuming. Who is that? And see, is, did he... Cosmo Queen, cool. Can't summon it, but I'm not going to, so it doesn't matter. Because I'm drawing him out. Blame Arcana for this audience and also the heart of the cards for not letting me draw Cosmo Queen. You saw it here first. I don't even... String is the last guy. Harpy's Feather Duster. Also would have been a great card. Can't use it now, though. Because I don't want to lose a shit ton of life points. And who knows where the other two face-down cards are. Harpy's Feather Duster. Too dangerous of a play right now. The AI is just freaking out. It's just summoning cards. Like, I still need to do stuff. Now, you can't do anything. I can't do anything. We'll just call it quits. What if you surrendered? AI? That'd be cool, right? You'd speed this up. I don't even know. I don't know how these are left. Fast forward. What if I just fast forwarded the rest of this? What? Why'd I lose? What? You drew out! You didn't have any cards left! What? Someone in the comments explain to me what the fuck just happened. Because he ran out of cards, right? Not me? I still don't understand what happened, why that just occurred. He drew out, I'm pretty sure. I'm gonna check the video, make sure I'm not an idiot. Maybe I was drawn out faster than he was, but I'm pretty sure I still had cards to draw. I'm mad about everything that just transpired there. That's so dumb. I guess I could have just fucking Harpy's Feather Duster killed but I would have only had 300 life points left. There's no way I would have beat the next guy with like 300 life points. Ooh, you activate your spell card, you creepy shit. I'm just angry now. Now I would have sworn. You just discarded like 17 cards. Pot of Greed. It's almost identical to the last time I dueled him. Do you have another Pot of Greed to play? No, okay. So whenever I attack, I'm going to assuredly, most assuredly, die instantaneously. So let's see. I mean, we can at least give it a, the old college try, right? Huh, get it? Because I'm in college. And we're trying. What's the point of his deck? Does he want to just... Draw me out? Oh, just desserts. Oh. No. Life absorption machine. No. What's What effects is he paying life points for? I don't remember. Whatever. Hopefully... Negate attack. He used it right this time. I think it was this guy. The duels are blending together. I'm going insane. Who knows? 
I just look at this ugly motherfucker. He's like trying to duel me. Get the fuck out. All right, let's just set you and then just hope for the best, I guess. Boom, attack. The Q team is the bane of my existence. They're just annoying. They're not even good duelists. They just have annoying strategies. Okay, you're dead. Don't have another one of those fucking enchantment things. This probably kills like 17 of my monsters, right? No, I think it just lets him draw like a level four. Right? He has Exodia? What? I don't remember that being a thing. All right, so now I gotta deal with an Exodia deck, of all things, in the middle of this. That's fine. He has only one piece at best. So let's play Harpy's Feather Duster. Don't know if it's anything else that would prevent him from doing stuff, but let's just... Oh, it's Torrential Tribute. And Trap Hole, okay. Those are both good plays by me, because I'm good. Yeah. <laughs> As I lost that last duel, embarrassingly enough. Let's see, Skull Dice isn't really needed. I can set Skull Dice anyway, just in case, but it's not going to have any relevance this turn. So let's attack with La Genie. Kill this thing. Three-headed Goliath, I'm assuming. I don't I didn't get time to read it. I don't really care. So I'm attacking directly with three monsters this turn. Dope. It's still not going to be enough to win, I don't think. Um, yeah, nope. Do a decent amount of damage to him, though, that's for sure. And then attack with you. We're almost done here. Next turn, I'll be in the clear. Hopefully, unless he's got... I didn't mean to go to main phase two. I just wanted to end my turn. And I gotta beat the next guy quick enough before he gets out all those fucking black pennants. Or draw Cosmo Queen. Like, when I want to draw her. Alright, this doesn't matter. Enter battle phase, win duel, check. Alright, kill this rare hunter guy, easy. No issue with rare hunter, dude. The issue comes from Arcana. Yeah, I lost. <coughs> Doing that voice <coughs> actually might have killed me. <laughs> We're good. I had to get more water because of that fucking dumb voice I did. It wasn't even a good voice, and I don't even know if you could have heard it on the mic. Because all I did was talk while I inhaled. Alright, uh, Royal Decree might be a good call here. I think what I'm going to do is set Maneater Bug and set it up for something big. And I'm going to avoid the trap holes by next turn playing Royal Decree and a monster that can attack. That's going to be my strategy, to just circumvent all the trap holes and fucking... Torrential Tributes, I'm sure he has. Wouldn't that be cool if all five of those were traps? It's probably pretty likely because no one really sets spell cards. Torrential Tribute, or er, Royal Decree, excuse me. Ha! I've stopped you in your tracks. Let's see, I don't have, okay. We'll play Alligator Sword because it's the first one in my hand. Trap Hole. Get fucked! Gotcha. No, you don't. Royal decree, motherfucker. And I royally decree that your fucking trap card doesn't work. Boom. Oh, another trap card. Just dropping them left and right. Ah, oh, royal decree. No. I'm too hype. Get fucked. Arcana. That's the strategy right there. It's just don't let him use his trap cards. Now my throat hurts. I also think I'm just drinking water a lot because it's right there. If it wasn't like right there, it might not. Are you gonna trap hole me? Oh, too bad. Too bad. Have you realized that your trap holes do nothing? Your enchanted javelin does nothing. Keep saying he's got me. I don't. Why would? It, the, why is the AI even instinctively activate its trap cards with Royal, Royal Decree out? Oh, cool! Another enchanted javelin. Every one of my attacks and or summons, besides summoning of Battle Axe, fucking <laughs> was trapped. It was like, oh, trap card, but I got Royal Decree in the first turn, which was clutch, and I made short work of this dude, unlike the other 20 minutes I spent dueling this guy. 
No, it was a blockbuster, dude. And your stupid fucking upside down mask. Didn't even get Dark Magician out. You suck. Look at this bald headed motherfucker. And his creepy ass humanoid slime. Is he not. Does he literally not say anything? That's even weirder. I think this guy, like. I think this is the guy Yugi got Slifer from. I think. He's weird, though. He looks weird. It looks like he has a lot of eyeliner, or just his eyes are really deep into his skull. Or, he's, yeah, he's just got, like, that raccoon eyeliner like every emo girl did in seventh grade. Ah. Okay. I wonder if I insulted anyone that watches this video by saying that. I'm sorry. Your eyeliner looks gorgeous. Or eyeshadow, I think it's more accurate to say. I don't know, makeup, man. I think it's... Whatever. I just... Why am I stopping to think about that? Fucking Mystic Tomato in attack mode because of its effect, which just got... What is this? What was the... Did you see him when he activated his trap? What? Alright, what does this do? You gain 500 life points when you draw a card. Okay. That's not good. Hopefully it won't matter, though, because I'm going to attack you. Now. Awesome. The attack went through. I had to stop and think about that one for a second. Okay. Humanoid, or... Humanoid tomato. Fucking... To oh, what the fuck was that? This dude's creepy as shit. When I attacked him, he was like... And he fucking had the Millennium... The thing... I'm ready for this duel to be over. I am very uncomfortable right now. I keep hitting no. Let's just... He's not... He's not there. We're not worried about him. I might put my ca I'm gonna put my camera over him. You can't see it. You'll have no idea what I'm talking about. That's creepy as shit, man. We're not gonna... I want to summon Cosmo Queen, but I don't want to hedge all my bets. On that one card. This trap hole. Yep. That would have been bad if I placed Cosmo Queen. I would have lost both my monsters. So good call. Me. Not summoning it. Boom. I might be able to win this turn. His like eyes go back into his head. Yeah, I could totally win this turn. Let's not see this guy ever again. He actually made noise though. He said, oof. I'm just uncomfortable now. I'm just un I'm just really uncomfortable. I'm also uncomfortable. Hey, I got a spell card! Oh, I don't even know what it was. I just am excited that I got a spell card. But next duel! Take on Esperoba, Loomis and Umbra, and Merrick. These are actually a bit more up. Because, you know, fucking Merrick is actually a notable character. So... Tune in next time to watch me actually take out a decent array of people. The other two, who cares? Americ is a top-level villain, so sweet. We're going to actually have decent people. No more Q-Team who actually beat me, because apparently I have to lose once at each tower before it becomes a legit thing. So, you know, thanks for watching, you guys. Remember to share, subscribe, all that good stuff. Follow me on Twitter and Twitch, and make sure you have a good day. And also... If you want to see me in some other videos, I'm in every other video on this channel. So, check out some of my other Let's Plays. I got a Halo one going on right now, Battle Block Theater, Gears of War. Those are three that are currently running and being uploaded as this speaks. Remember to be leaving feedback and all that good stuff. I think this might be too long of an outro. A lot of you probably have already exited out. Let me know if you didn't exit out of this and you're actually hearing this comment. Because you're awesome. See you around. Bye. Thank you.